Hi everybody. Okay, so day two of celery. And uh, as far as the sink issue, I noticed that it was perfectly fine when I played it back from my Mac, but when I send it over uh, through Google Drive and then play it back on my other PC, that's when I'm having issues. So I am going to try to do this vlog uh, so I don't have to really do any editing and just put it up there. So basically, so day two, like I said, correction as far as the weight I started at. I think I said or put in the description 135.4, but actually in my uh, handy dandy journal, I had written down that it was 135.7. So I was a little bit off on that, apologize. But good news is this morning I uh, weighed in and I was 133.5. So that was a nice, that was a nice little surprise as far as, um, uh, you know, nice, nice release of uh, weight. So, but I, I must admit, because I don't like celery, this isn't really very fun. Plus, I feel like Goldilocks because yesterday I kept trying to sprinkle salt just like into this little, this thing. Um, but then I didn't feel like I had enough salt. So then I decided, okay, I'm going to put salt in here. Um, and then dip it into the, the little bowl. But the problem is now I feel like it's, there's too much salt. So I don't know. Um, I also didn't start eating it again till later in the day. What's up with that? Uh, in the mornings, I still have my uh, apple cider vinegar shot. And I also um, do my, my lemon juice. Uh, that's just kind of a staple of mine. There's also some detoxification teas that I've been drinking, gosh, ever since, like, years, like, since 2011. So that's quite some time ago that I started that. And so I just do it every morning. Tastes terrible, but I still do it. Um, so anyway, uh, that's kind of the update. I must say, though, that I'll be glad when this one is done. I was, I, I got cranky today. And again, I think it was between not really looking forward to eating the celery and then putting off eating the celery, which then caused me to like, of course, have more hunger. Because the thing, thing about, if you just, just you plain old fasting, you hit a point where your the hunger pain just kind of does subside. But whenever you put something down into your system, uh, I feel like always just then triggers that your body is gonna want something else down the line. Uh, and I just hit a point where I made the mistake. I thought I was helping someone with something around the house and I was too hot, too hungry, and too thirsty, and I just kind of went as far as like, I'm just fed up. So yeah, don't do that. Um, so yeah, I think that's it, but I guess I was very pleased with that release because that was like, you know, a couple of pounds, which isn't bad at all. Um, but I think next week I'll be going back to probably a mono fruit diet. I just haven't decided what that mono fruit will be. But I am aiming towards a fruit that is known to have enzymes in it that helps um, break things up in your system and gets things flushed out. So that's what I'm uh, gonna be gearing towards. I'll kind of do some research and see which one I wanna land on. But especially with this being the summer months, I think it really is definitely a lot easier to do those because there's a lot of fruits out there that later we won't have access to as well. Or we may have access, but they won't be as tasty. So I'd rather have them when they're tasty. Uh, and that's, I'm going to say that that's it for now. I have to do another uh, vlog, actually introduction to a vlog really quick. And now that one probably will be out of sync because I definitely have to piece uh, them all together. But just a little promo here. Um, it's about if you've ever wondered about cryotherapy sessions. Um, I did a couple of them. And I also had the gentleman that worked at the establishment explain the benefits and what it does, what it does, and why it does what it does. And there are a lot of people that are very interested in that as far as uh, definitely friends and family of mine have wanted to see the footage. Some of them have seen it before, put it on YouTube uh, because it shows me actually going through the session itself. And uh, it's, it's okay, you guys are already watching this. I don't, you're either watching this because you wanna cleanse your system from something or you're wanting to drop some weight. Well, the cryo session burns anywhere from 500 to 800 calories and you're in there like for three minutes. So sounds pretty good to me. All right, that's it. I said about that, that's it. And uh, I'll let you go for now. Wish me luck for the rest of the day on Tuesday. 
And then Wednesday will be my final third day on the wonderful celery. Oh, don't eat the leaves. They are freaking bitter and are disgusting. So I learned the hard way that you cut away the leaves. Don't, don't eat the leaves. Everything else just tastes like celery. All right. Thanks a lot. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to comment, please. And uh, putting a like in there would definitely help too. I would appreciate that very much. Um, I kind of am hoping that it's the thing where if I help you, you can help me and we all help each other and we're all happy people. All right. Thank you. Have a great day. Bye.